Hi guys, it's me, Teacher Don. In our today's video, we will continue our discussion with regard to integral calculus. And to be specific, we will discuss how to use integration by use substitution. Actually, meron lang tayong mga ng video na patungkol sa integration by use substitution. And by request nga, I am creating more videos about integral calculus para mas marami sa inyo matuto kung paano ba mag kumuha ng integration or integral ng isang given expression. So, without further ado, let's do this topic. So, I have here two different examples wherein we are given the direction, evaluate the following. So, ang idea lang guys, uh, bakit tayo gumagamit ng u substitution? Meron kasi mga given integral na mahirap makuha yung integral nito kapag gumamit tayo ng power rule. So, ang tendency, meron tayong another uh, possible way on how to find the integral of an expression or a function gamit yung u substitution. So let's have number 1. In number 1, we are given the integral of the quantity 8x minus 12 times the quantity of 4x squared minus 12x raised to the 4th power dx. So again, from my previous video, I have mentioned na ang naging problema dito ay yung determine which one yung gagamitin natin expression to represent to be represented by letter u. Now, so the, some expression dito yung gagamitin natin a letter u. We have your 8x minus 12. Yung isa naman, 4x squared minus 12x. Yung iba, ang ginagawa nila dito ay kapag complicated itong expression na to, again, kapag complicated yung expression na to, I will use this as u. Hindi yung ganun, hindi ganun yung rule natin. Pero, uh, nagiging, nagiging tama siya. So, Punta natin, sir, paano ba tayo pumili ng letter u? So, comparing this one, you have 8x minus 12, and you have 4x squared minus 12x. So, sir, ano ba yung basis natin? Ang basis ko dito, guys, dapat kapag kinuha mo yung u, dapat yung derivative niya ay yung isang expression. So, let's say, for example, uh, your, your u here is 8x minus 12. So, imagine... If you will find the derivative of your u, 8x minus 12, ang lalabas ba ay yung 4x squared minus 12x? Hindi. Kasi ang derivative ng 8x minus 12 is simply 8. Okay? So ngayon, sir, hindi pwede yung ano, 8x minus 12 bilang u. Ibig sabihin po ba yung 4x squared minus 12x ay yung u natin? Let's try. If you, you will find the derivative of 4x squared minus 12x, it will give us your du be equal to uh, 2 times 4, that is 8x, and the derivative of negative 12x is minus 2. As you can see, ito na siya. So, ibig sabihin, tama yung ating u bilang 4x squared minus 12x. So, let's continue and use integration by u substitution. So, as you can see, um, u is equal to 4x squared minus 12x. Tapos yung du naman natin is equal to 12 Ah, sorry, 8x minus 12. So, mangyari dito ngayon, guys, using u substitution, I will replace this expression by u. So, gagamit natin dito, integral of u to the 4th power. Sir, bakit po u to the 4th power? Guys, remember, this is u. U to u. And then to the 4th power. At ito naman, dalawang ito, 8x minus 12. Sorry, meron tayo dito dapat dx. Yeah, 8x minus 12 dx natin ay magiging du nila. So you have the integral of u to the 4th power du. And then we will apply the power rule. For the power rule, simple lang naman yung guys, you have u to the 4th power plus 1. Mag plus 1 tayo ah. Siyempre, sa denominator din, you will add 4 and 1. Tapos, lagyan mo na dito ng plus C. And simplifying the exponents in your denominator, you have U to the 5th power over 5 plus C. Yung iba, instead of writing, writing it as U to the 5th power over 5, ginagawa nila dito, ito. Uh, hiniwalin nila, ginagawa nilang 1 over 5 U to the 5th power. And what's next, sir? Ang next natin dito, is go back to your representation wherein your u is equal to 4x squared minus 12. At itong expression na to ay ipapalit natin dito. 
So our new answer, or our new expression here is 1 over 5. And then your u is 4x squared minus 12x. So you have 4x squared minus 12x. And then raised to, how many? 5th power plus c. Ito na yung mismo sagot natin for item number 1. Ganun lang kasimple yung ating ano paggamit ng u substitution. Ang pinaka-crucial na talaga dito ay yung pagpili which expression is to be represented by the letter u. Pero I hope na ano, yung example natin ay makatulong sa inyo para mas madali kayo makapag-decide kung aling expression yung gagamitin nyo bilang u. Let's continue. For number 2, we are given uh, 4x, an uh, integral of 4x times the, the, times the quantity of x squared plus 5 cubed dx. So, mayroon tayong two different expression. We have 4x and an x squared plus 5. So, isipin natin ngayon. If I will choose u be equal to x squared plus 5, kapag ginawa natin yung derivative nito or yung du nito, we have 2x pero 4x to. Pero don't worry. Halos magkawig na magagawin tayong uh, step dyan para makuha natin yung uh, magamit natin yung u substitution. So dito, derivative of x squared plus 5 is equal to 2x dx. Now, um, next step natin dito, we will divide this by 2x. By 2x. Cancel, cancel. And you have here du over 2x is equal to dx. I hope na wala akong maling solution. Now, after this, let's use u substitution. So, nagay natin dito ngayon. Hmm, next step natin. Yung ating u. Ito. We have here the integral of 4x muna siguro. 4x. And then times. Ito. Magiging u to the third power. Tapos, as you can see, Hindi ko pinatan yung 4x ha. Tapos itong x squared plus 5 natin, naging ganito. We have here dx. Remember, your dx here is equal to du over 2x. Ngayon, pwede tayo mag-cancellation. Kung mapansin mo, we can cancel out 2x. Itong 4x na natin magiging uh, 4x divided by 2x is simply to magkakaroon tayo ngayon ng constant. Okay? Nakakaroon tayo ngayon ng constant. So, we will rewrite our expression bilang 2, ilabas natin yung constant, integral of u cubed, okay, and then du. Now, let's apply the power rule. Next natin dito, we have 2 times u raised to the third power plus 1 over 3 plus 1 and then plus c. Okay? So, ito ngayon, Simplify natin, we have 2 times 2 times u to the 4th power over 4 plus c. So as you can see, meron tayo 2 sa 4. We can eliminate this 2 sa ating numerator. Ito naman magiging 2 na lang din. Ibig sabihin, if you will continue our solution, ito na siya, magiging um, u to the 4th power, uh, 1 half u to the 4th power plus C. And, okay ito guys, balik tayo sa ating ano, representation wherein your u variable is the same as x squared plus 5. So this is 1 over 2 times x squared plus 5 to the 4th power plus C. Ito na ngayon yung, ano, yung indefinite integral of the given expression um, the integral of 4x times the quantity of x squared plus 5 to the third power dx. I hope guys, nasa mismo video natin, uh, you learned something on how to use integration by u substitution. So, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe at hit na rin bell button for you to be updated sa ating latest uploads. Again, it's me, Teacher Goyne. Maraming maraming salamat. Bye-bye. See you sa ating next video.